For you plastic kayak owners, here are some ideas on how to repair some minor damage using a plastic welder. You can buy this welder from your local Harbor Freight store. When you plug in the welder, the triangular tip gets hot enough to melt plastic. The welder has no temperature control, so I like to use my home-built temperature controller to reduce the heat. I wired a lamp dimmer and outlet, which were mounted in an electrical box. Alternatively, you can plug and unplug the welder to control the temperature. Slivers that are partially attached can be ironed back. Clean the area first, then use a flat tip to melt the sliver back into the original surface. Use quick motions to avoid creating a depression, but make sure the sliver is hot enough to melt back into the boat. When you need to fill a gouge or hole, the added plastic should be close in color and resin composition of the boat. The best source is repair plastic from the kayak factory. Tap Plastics sells thin HDPE plastic in various colors. You can also try plastic tarp. The common plastic containers are a good source of plastic. Use a container that matches your boat color, but make sure it has the HDPE2 recycling symbol. Cut thin strips from the container. Filling a hole requires a piece of aluminum tape on the other side. The tape keeps excess plastic from spilling beyond the other surface. Also, the tape prevents buckling in case of overheating. Place the welding plastic in contact with the hole and use a pointed tip to melt the plastic into the hole. The boat plastic should simultaneously be heated. Don't try to fill the hole in one pass but allow the plastic to cool slightly to prevent buckling and to allow you to inspect the weld as you proceed. Although not shown, aluminum tape can be used as a mask to prevent excess plastic from spreading too far beyond the hole. The front tape would have a slightly larger hole to expose the plastic hole. You would peel off the front tape before the plastic cools and then smooth the area around the hole. You just saw the low-cost plastic welder in action. The repairs are color matched and durable. You can run the welder from your car's battery if you need to do a field repair.